for details observing Pluto both in sunlight and as it was illuminated by Charon. Pluto's atmosphere resembles that of Neptune's moon Triton, but it's thicker, despite Triton being more massive. Scientists once thought Pluto might have clouds but New Horizons only showed a layered haze. And contrary to expectations Pluto's nitrogen atmosphere didn't escape into space as much as we thought. This suggests that something is replenishing it. The nitrogen might be coming from Pluto's interior through geysers or ice volcanoes. Some mountains on Pluto could be these ice volcanoes although none have been spotted yet. Interestingly, Pluto's atmosphere might completely collapse and freeze by 2030. With its long 248-year orbit and extreme distance from the Sun, Pluto's surface stays extremely cold, between minus 378 and minus 396 degrees Fahrenheit. So there you have it. Despite its tiny size and distant location, Pluto boasts a surprisingly robust and intriguing atmosphere. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to